Hello everyone and welcome to Axiom Verge. This is a game I heard about a little while back and I haven't actually had the opportunity to play it, but now that I do, uh, I figured why not do a let's play of it, so let's do that. So, I know pretty much nothing about the game, so I think we're gonna go with normal mode. I feel like that's, you know, a better uh, option for my life. So it's New Mexico 2005. I wonder if my controller works. I just realized I've got it plugged in. I don't need to. I probably don't need to use the keyboard. We'll give that a shot. What do we got going on here? Video one. Scientist. Dude with glasses. Other dude with glasses. Trace and Hammond. If only what would work. Well, it's doing something. So that's a sign. Wave. Bad joke. So basically, for those of you who don't know anything, know a little bit less than I do, as a matter of fact, uh, I don't mean that in a mean way or anything. Basically, who, for those of you who don't know anything about this game in any way, shape, or form, it's very, very Metroid do. Very, very Metroid reference y like, and I, for those who don't know, am a big Nintendo fan believe it or not. Shocking, I know, since there's like nothing ever Nintendo related on my channel or anything. But, yeah, like, my first non-Nintendo console was actually the Xbox 360, and my first er, game for it was Skyrim. My second game was Dark Souls. Yeah. Okay, so the controller does work, it does something, lets me go through dialogue. What happened? Things went boom. There's gun in the next room. Hello? Okay, I can do both work. How do I jump? Crouching. Do I want to use the analog stick or do I want to use the D-pad? I'm thinking D-pad. It just feels right for this style of game, you know what I mean? So, X to fire. I am very weak. Before he finds you, ooh. Okay. Angles. Alright, that's easy enough to understand. Okay, let's save it. That way I don't have to go through all the dialogue again. Man, this game is making me just nostalgia so hard right now. It's reminding me of the time I spent playing the original Metroid. I want to find secret things and stuff. Okay, come on. I want to aim down at an angle. Okay, that did something though. What button did I hit just then? Is it the left bumper? Aha! That locks me in place. Well, they they don't do anything, so... Something tells me I'll have to come back here. I wish I could aim at an angle and run. That would be nice. Let's see what's in here. Okay, those are just background decorations. I'm assuming that's a switch, which means this is still not the proper direction. Also no. That's 
thing. Okay, those are shooting down at angles. Meaning they can't get me from here. Funky red stuff must be health. Going up. Going up. Cool. Give me healths, please. Okay, that's not the right direction, I guess. So, slight waste of time there. Nothing hidden behind those either. Bit of a shame. Oh, I see you. Sneaking up towards me. Yeah, take those angled shots. I did not see the last one. See, this is like classic level design sort of stuff right here. Switch on this side that I can get to. Switch here I can't get to. So I'm gonna have to go forward. And once I go through this door, that's gonna or this portal, this tube, call it what you will. Before I, once I go through this, it will lock, and then I will have to get the new item somewhere along this path. It just makes sense. Funky language is funky. Nova. Select with up on the right pad. Okay. Ooh. So it's just, it's literally another gun. Cool. Do like. Wonder how it does more damage, if I explode it, or if I... Timing on that's a little awkward. Hmm. I assume it does more damage if it's a direct hit. But this offers cheese strats. Many, many cheese strats. Although the damage on that seems to be doing a lot because it's hitting with multiple of the bursts. Hmm. Okay then. Let's get moving. Whoop. Did not see that one there. Let's go this way.
they're apparently too stupid to get over here to me. Not that I'm complaining. Because they nearly wrecked me. New enemy types, always difficult to learn how to deal with. But that's okay, we'll manage. Because health. Something. Size node. Permanently increases projectile size for weapons. Cool. Does that affect both? I think it did. Well, that's convenient. Does it affect damage, though? That's the question. can go up here. I recognize those blocks. They can be destroyed, just not quite yet. That just screams further path to me. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go save, because that's just what makes sense. I mean, I got a bunch of new things. I don't want to have to, you know, I don't know how dying in this game works quite yet. I don't want to have to, you know, lose everything and then start over from the save point I was at originally. I doubt that it'll be that way. It'll probably be just like Metroid where you have to, you know, start over but you keep what you picked up. Either way, it doesn't sound, it doesn't sound like a good idea. Okay, that's that one. I don't know why I jumped that way first. Here we are. I see those pincers. And I know what those mean. Unfriendly things. What is that? I want that. That looks like... I don't know. I'll figure that out eventually. Huh, that enemy didn't respawn. Let's go this way. Let's not go this way. Let's go the other way first. Because that just screams boss to me. I don't know about you guys, but something just tells me that means boss. And where there's a boss, there's a save! Hooray! Okay, so... Then I'm assuming it is definitely exactly like how Metroid is. Let's go take out a boss, guys. And it even marked it on the map as a green area. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh, hello there. Crap, I'm trapped. Demon. Wait, that's a person? There's a person in that thing? Ooh. Okay, this is easy. What do those do? Oh, they explode. Okay. Oh, 
That's easy enough. I think it has a lot of health, though, actually. There we go. Just gotta work on the patterns. Got a new attack in a way. Oops. Okay, this is time consuming. There we go. Success. Achievement unlocked. Zeter? Man. I don't really need all that health. I can't actually even get all that health. Okay. What do we get for doing that? Oh, hey, it's probably the thing to destroy those things. Laser drill. Use with the right trigger. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I like that. Oh, and this will get me that thing that was on the other side, won't it? No, no it won't. Okay, I'm just gonna do this the easy way instead of switching my weapon. Unless I don't need to. Oh, I don't. That's cool. Is this a... It does harm enemies. This does what for me? Permanently increases weapon and item damage. Yeah. I like this thing. I like this thing very much. Whoops. So you better believe I'll be checking literally everywhere to see if things are, uh, breakable. Because there's probably a lot of stuff that is. Still, I like how this is going and giving you different items and weapons instead of just being a straight, uh, addition to what you had. I do, in fact, like that very much. You know what? There's that path that went up. This stake me. Wow, okay, they explode on contact. Health, I need that. Get up that way. What's this red spot? Mm. 
I got a new thingy. Lots of new thingies. Multi disruptor fires three projectiles at a time. Ooh. Hmm. Well, I'll definitely have to be coming back to here because I, I don't think I can get any farther. That's okay though. New toy. Hooray. Okay, why is that there? I just have to go find out. Because what if there's a thing that I can do? Okay, multi disruptor is a lot weaker. Hmm. Ah, uh, there's probably nothing hidden there anyway. Need to get used to this whole drilling thing. I don't know why I bothered with that. Okay, let's go run back and give it a save, because I will say that this is good for uh, running through stuff like that, because it shoots out at the three levels, I don't have to worry about, you know, everything being blocked still. But, you know, I think, guys, this is actually going to be a good spot to end things for the first episode. Got a fair bit of work done, I think, I don't know exactly how long this game is, but I'm enjoying it quite a bit so far, so there will definitely be more of this coming, and uh, I hope you all enjoy it. Hope you continue to enjoy it, so on and so forth, and I will see you guys all next time.